Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I will show you a simple way how you can create ClickUp tasks from new Google Form responses. So how to do it, I'm going to show you straight away. First thing you want to do is just click on the link down below in the description. And when you're going to do it, you'll get right here to sign up of make.com. Make.com is amazing, it's going to help you combine and also connect various applications. And when you're going to do it and you're going to like sign up with Facebook, Gmail completely for free. You're going to end up right here in organization. Here under scenario, you're going to find templates. And you want to click on the template and then go to top right and right click up. And then also sheets. Archie oh, forms, forms. Google forms. And right here we got it. Create a click up tasks from new uh, Google form responses. So choose that. And here you're going to have it. So every time a new response is entered on your Google form, Integromat will automatically create a new task in ClickUp. So then on the bottom left, you're going to have create new scenario from the template. And then you're going to have connection here. And you're going to have spreadsheet. Then you have to connect like with your accounts with the Google forms and then also with the ClickUp. So now when you're going to have the connection, you have to connect your ClickUp to. It's nothing that difficult. So click add here and click save. And you're just going to authorize it. Connect the workspace. This is how simply you're going to like authorize it. And then you just have to uh, have a workspace here. Then also the space and folder and list. So you're going to have the task name, the content and all what you were like asking the questions uh, in your form, you would just edit right here. So let's say this would be uh, a name, task name, a content would be, let's say, like you can have an email. So whatever you're trying to do and get uh, in your ClickUp like the names of your columns, you would get from the forms that you're asking questions in. Then you would press continue here. And then what you have to do is just easily save it. And you can run it once to test it out if it actually works. And on the bottom, you see that it's working. So on the bottom, you would click save. Now, if you can have any questions, you can ask to make.com customer support. They are really helpful and they will help you with everything. So that's pretty much it how we do this. So thank you very much and have a great day and goodbye. See ya.